Hi, it's Joey from DayJobHacks.com and today I want to talk about what are the best CPA affiliate offers to focus on right now when we have a global pandemic as well as a potential stock market crash or recession. Okay, if you're like me, then you are getting bombarded with emails every single day from CPA affiliate networks or other traffic sources out there. Uh, I've been doing this for a while, so I get a lot of emails from these companies, and a lot of them have changed their focus lately to all of what's happening around the world right now. And a couple of weeks ago, we had the, you know, the, the networks coming out, sending out messages about, you know, we have coronavirus offers and all this stuff, and they were bragging, and it was kind of really sleazy, I thought. Over the past couple of weeks, the tone has changed quite a bit. We know that the world is, is, is hurting right now in many places, and I'm sure a lot of networks are realizing how sleazy that was, and now you're seeing a lot of networks sending out messages, you know, please don't say anything about this virus in your ads, all that kind of stuff. So what do we do as affiliate marketers that are ethical, that want to still you know, make money during this time? We need to make money, we need to pay our bills as well, we need to you know, keep and maintain our business as well. So in my last email I sent out to uh, the subscribers at powerhouseaffiliate.com, I mentioned that I have two businesses. I have an online business and an offline business, okay? The offline business is in real estate and the online business is also in real estate except it's online real estate. So. Uh, it's no surprise that the online business is doing much better right now than the offline business. So I want to focus on the online stuff and a lot of the stuff I do is CPA affiliate marketing. So I want to go into my computer, show some trends that I'm looking at, what the other traffic sources and networks are saying in terms of what's working right now. A lot of them are obvious to people right now, but I thought there's a lot of people that watch this channel that are looking to get into CPA affiliate marketing and there are niches out there that can survive during something as drastic as what's going on right now in the world. In fact, I have a couple of websites that are doing extremely well. In fact, they're doing better now with everybody staying at home and doing what they do. I guess they go on the internet, they read the news, they click on ads and all that kind of stuff. So that is still happening and it's probably happening a lot more than it was before. Some places are getting more traffic, some people are getting less traffic. I'm gonna show you that data as we get into my computer. But the challenge is still there for affiliates to find winning campaigns. There's a lot of opportunity right now to do it right without you know, being a sleaze bag and doing unethical stuff by promoting these medical kits that are nothing more than a $20 jackknife or promoting these face mask offers and all this stuff. You don't need to get into that. You don't need to do that kind of stuff, okay? There are, in fact, a lot of offers right now and a lot of places that people want to use, like gaming, for example. Um, there's streaming. There, we're going to see all of this as soon as we get into my computer, but I just wanted to mention that before we get in there, okay? So if you're looking for CPA affiliate campaigns that you can run right now that will last into the future, then come on into the computer. Let's get in there and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so well, I first thought maybe we could just look at a few of the sources that I'm, I'm referencing here so we could talk about what is actually happening with regard to online traffic. There's a few sources I wanted to go over. This is an email I received from Propeller Ads. They are a push, not push notification network that you can buy ads from, okay? I've done a case study on Propeller, how to buy traffic there, how to get clicks, okay? They are saying right now, as of March 27th, 2020, they're saying the biggest traffic growth has happened in content sites. That makes sense, okay? People are online, they're searching for stuff online. If you have content and you're doing arbitrage, for example, using AdSense on your web pages, um, people are going to those content sites, they are clicking on the ads, they are click happy, and they're reading content, okay? Big spike in traffic there obviously makes sense. Next one is movie streaming, okay? This makes sense as well. Now, in my previous videos where I've done case studies inside powerhouseaffiliate.com, I've shown actual examples of movie streaming and sports streaming campaigns. In fact, on my YouTube channel, there are a couple of examples where I reference sports streaming. Now, I spoke to a streaming company this morning, and in fact, they are seeing the same spike, okay? Movie streaming, let's be specific here. Sports streaming is actually collapsing as we speak, obviously because there's no sports going on, okay? So if you're into sports streaming and you're into sports betting, there's probably gonna be a hit 
tier traffic right now, which only makes sense. However, there's gonna be a lot of people looking to watch movies online. There are streaming offers out there. In fact, we have one inside Vault Media. If you want access to Vault Media CPA private network, join powerhouseaffiliate.com. You can have access to this movie streaming offers we have. We have actually a few streaming offers. Um, social websites make sense. They're up, uh, people are on social media. Now, other ones, which offers to run? Let's look at games. Obviously, games is gonna be a big one as well. People are, people are already starting to you know, play more games. They have time on their hands. I've been playing actually a lot more chess while I sit upstairs, um, bored sometimes. I'm, well, actually, I'm not bored too often, let's be honest. I've got a, a couple of kids, a couple of dogs. But if I ever have a spare minute, I'm gonna throw up a game of chess and play it, okay? Um, I, I'm, I know my daughter's playing a little more Roblox right now. There's other games out there that are obviously massive games you can you can get. If you want to run gaming offers, where do you find them? Well, you just go to a place like OfferVault.com and search for gaming offers, okay? Again, streaming subscriptions. I recently also, this is the same thing as movie streaming, but there's also Disney+, Plus, Netflix, other ones like that out there that are also spiking in traffic. Even In fact, their stocks are even going up in these companies because people know that they're going to get a ton of new subscribers right now. Sweepstakes, generally from what I'm seeing around all of the emails I'm reading is that sweepstakes just seems to be one of those places that is always going to work, okay? People are interested in getting free stuff. Sweepstakes is generally around getting something for free by giving your email. So obviously this is gonna to continue to work. The question is, is will these sweepstakes offers be able to monetize their back ends considering what's happening right now in the world with call centers, with delivery, all that kind of stuff, okay? So however they're monetizing their back end is probably gonna be challenging. So that means that there's going to be limited cap on some offers. You're probably gonna be hit with quality issues if you go too aggressive, so be careful running sweeps. Um, I like running the ones with subscriptions because people enter a credit card and it's really hard to get bad quality if you're getting people to submit a credit card, okay? But again, with that, considering that credit cards may be maxed out here pretty soon, then you might also be getting low rebill rates on the subscriptions. Apt, another killer one that is clearly one of the biggest, I think, opportunities right now. And I'm gonna show you another article that speaks of this in a minute. Utilities, again, same thing. The biggest traffic drops, okay? So let's talk about what's happening here. Actually, they didn't show it. Sports streaming, oh, there it is right there. Okay, so I said that earlier, but I'm, I'm guessing also travel is a big, huge, major drop. Anybody that's doing any kind of free airline ticket sweepstakes offers or anything like that, it's probably not. Uh, cashing in big right now, okay? So let's look at something else. Here's Neil Patel's blog, okay? Here's another source of information that I found out there while I was uh, doing some research. And he's talking about his own business. He runs a media agency, so he's doing a lot of search engine optimization for other companies, as I understand. And so from the data that he is seeing, now this is limited data because he only has clients in certain areas, so it's not everything. But from what he's seeing, he's seeing a drop in advertising spend. I'm assuming people are spending less in advertising right now. Agriculture's down, construction, e-com, makes sense because of delivery issues and all that kind of stuff. Education, um, surprisingly, is down, unless it's online education, or offline education, I mean. Uh, you would think online education would have an increase, but uh, according to this, it's showing a decrease. Uh, energy down, finance up. A good uh, a good indicator that financial CPA lead generation offers will work but again the challenge is do they have a call center that they are relying on and do they have a solution in place to take those leads um, we have food is up another great one uh, if you can find a food delivery type of CPA offer those ones I hear are crushing right now yeah, and I think it will work in the future people are going to be more apt to use it once they know how to use it a lot of these services that people are getting right now and are spiking are things that they never would have thought of doing before once you start doing something you learn it you you like it and all of a sudden you become a client forever okay so this is what's happening I think it's the same is gonna happen with streaming people that never thought of doing movie streaming before are now coming online watching Netflix and like oh wow this is actually great I might keep it forever you know, that's that's the thing here. So a lot of these companies are building their audience right now in, in a time when a lot of companies are collapsing. A lot of them are actually growing drastically right now. 
Um, healthcare, another obvious one. So insurance down, manufacturing down, media up. So a lot of people reading the news, going online, clicking on ads, and that makes sense. Pharmacy up. <clears throat> real estate down, I can totally vouch for that one. My real estate company offline is taking a hit right now only because the, not because of the people renting, but more that the services I need for the, the units, like plumbers and people that hook up power, people that hook up the water, and, and, and fix things, you know, those people are now not um, as readily available due to what's happening in the world right now. So that, that kind of hurts the real estate business. Retail down, software, tech, telecom, transportation, travel. Travel is the biggest drop. That makes sense, obviously, okay? So another article I wanna get into quickly before I show you what people are actually advertising. See if we can confirm a couple of these things, okay? Well, we'll check a spy tool here in a minute, but first, another one that I saw that was good. Um, well, Google Trends is another place you can check out what's happening. You can see what people are actually searching right now on Google Trends, and most of it is clearly related to the um, coronavirus. And if I just come over here and click on trending searches, you'll see what I'm talking about here. So you can see COVID-19 is the top search for today. Um, yesterday was Mark Blum, Carol Baskin. These are some of the top searches on Google in the US. Unemployment, big one. IRS, so tax stuff is going to be big right now. What else do we have here? Music and probably a lot of streaming, if you can see anything here. I think they're, oh, so Ozark season three, there's people searching for. So you're gonna see people searching for TV shows, music, all that kind of stuff, how they can stream it. So you can actually see that in the Google search trends, okay? Uh, one more article I thought was really interesting, and this is the one from eConsultancy.com, okay? Um, they're talking about some certain things that they're seeing in their data. Travel, obviously, again, one of the ones that's having a huge decline right now. So don't get into travel offers right now. It's not going to work for you um, in, in any respect. You may, maybe if you build a big website around travel, it might last later on. But right now, it's probably not the best area to focus on unless that's your real, true passion. Um, <coughs> sorry. Moving down, retail, um, again, they are, uh, what is this one saying? 50% of Chinese and 31% of Italian consumers say they are using e-com. So e-com is growing, assuming that they have the distribution channels in place for that. So you can see, we'll confirm this when we look at the traffic and where people are advertising, but I have seen a lot of e-com offers up and these are probably companies that have a good solid supply and they also have good delivery mechanisms in place because that is also a major thing to consider is how are they delivering right now and will they be able to deliver into the next few months? Um, what else do we have? We have retail industry forecasts to lose 12 billion. So I'm guessing that is offline um, retail. US grocery apps, that's a big one, okay? Downloaded, so the apps and the installs. Look for installs that talk about, you know, getting deliveries, getting food, grocery apps. You can, I think I saw a stat somewhere about uh, the Walmart. Oh yeah, it was actually this article. 160% growth in app downloads just for the Walmart app. So if you can find apps that you can get paid on for installations, that is a great opportunity. I actually saw some the other day that I might actually promote. Where would you promote these, you ask? Well, actually, there are push ads, there are search ads, you can do native ads, social media ads, all of these will work. I've done paid case studies on, case studies on paid traffic, showing how to get traffic to these offers, okay? Check them out, powerhostaffiliate.com. Again, go in there, check out our case studies, webinars, and all that fun stuff, and you can get access to actually exactly how to get the traffic to get these downloads, okay? So apps, again, another good one. Uh, here's more on grocery delivery, advertising. Mm, not much here about CPA stuff that we can look at. Social ads are going to be big. Entertainment, Netflix, there you go. So Netflix, Disney+, Plus, any other streaming service you can find. PC gaming, another big one that we're going to be looking at for, you know, offers. There's tons of gaming offers for CPA affiliates. That's where you should be focusing your time right now if, uh, if, you, if you can. Employment and recruitment, another obvious one. So look for unemployment offers or employment offers. So any uh, lead generation companies, or there, there's a lot of companies out there looking for leads to join their employment sites, okay? 
So if you can find those offers, again, go to offervault.com, look for search for employment or recruitment, and I'm sure you'll find something. Let's just do that quickly right now to see if there is something about that topic, okay? So you come into Offer Vault, search employment, and now you're gonna find all these CPA offers related to employment, okay? So maybe there are some, maybe there aren't. There's back to school lending and all this stuff. Another topic obviously that's gonna work is finance, lending, loans, all that stuff, okay? So anyway, if you, if you wanna just come in here and use that tool, it's free, so something to look at. Uh, let's just quickly go down here and look again. Social media is going to be up and that's about it. So there's a bunch of traffic, or, or sorry, there's a bunch of topics and, and, and stuff that we can promote, a lot of good offer areas that we can focus on that I think will work well. The last place I wanna go to just kinda prove the theory is to go into a spy tool and see what people are actually search, or setting up ads for right now. All right, so here we are inside Adplexity. Adplexity is a tool I use a lot. I am an affiliate for Adplexity. If you want to use Adplexity, you can support my channel by going to dayjobhacks.com slash Adplexity. I use it, it's a great tool. It shows you what is happening in the industry right now. What are people advertising currently in this space, okay? So this is uh, days running right over here on the left side, you can see uh, this this tool will basically scrape all the new sites out there and see what native ads are running currently Okay, so it gives you a general idea of what is actually out there Okay, you can filter it all the way down to affiliates and, and affiliate networks traffic sources over here on the left Affiliate, uh, you know tracking tools you can see all the volume links and whatever else Okay, but what I'm looking at right now is just the last day of running. Okay, so what is just coming up? Okay, so this means these are ads that have just been seen in the last day, which means they're likely to be new ads, okay? So looking here, we're gonna see some trends, okay? We're going to see people are still doing diet, that makes sense, healthcare, all that fun stuff. We have, uh, what else do we have? Let's just uh, come over here for a second. I'm just gonna focus on one country to make it a little easier to see the search results here. So a lot of the traffic I run is in the US, you can see here we have a finance offer. We have Netflix, makes sense. There's the streaming. We have homeowners save thousands. So saving thousands as a homeowner is clearly a financial offer. We need to save money. We need to prepare our homes for the worst, um, especially uh, in the midst of a, an economy that is you know, somewhat going really down fast. Uh, we have again, solar panels. So living off of energy that we don't have to buy. It's less expensive. Again, uh, something that I think will work well. Coming down, 10 reasons you should plan on an evening trek. So you can see there's just a ton of different stuff. Here is an e-com offer, okay? So somebody is actually promoting e-com. That is a tech watch. So you can sell stuff. Here's another e-com. We have a lot of finance. All these ones with old people are, are likely financial offers. We have auto insurance. Medical again over here Diet 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 so everybody's on a diet everybody's still concerned about their health obviously and it's working Okay um, More financial I Don't see as much streaming as I thought I would but I'm sure if I was to do a specific search right up here and put streaming I could probably see a lot of offers and ads running right now in the streaming space. So as you can see, yes. As soon as I filter out to what I wanna look at, you can see all of the ads here for streaming and technology that allows me to watch stuff online, okay? So coming back into what uh, Neil was saying here, if we look at maybe the food industry, and we want to see what's happening with ads in the food delivery. We could perhaps find some here if we put food delivery and see if there's something that comes up with respect to that type of offer. Um, let's see here. Uh, I did find one here. Dinnerly was one, but not a lot, surprisingly. So that might be an opportunity there to find a food delivery offer and kind of tap into some traffic here. Um, so these are just some of the ideas you can find. You can see there's a lot of areas that we can make money as CPA affiliates. There's lots of offers out there we can find. If you need to find offers, there are networks out there. Like uh, Max Bounty is one that I, 
I usually put into my videos. There's lots of offers here. There's I sorted the offers here by EPC so you can see the top earnings per click on these offers. Uh, I don't generally go by the network earnings per click only because it's based on all of the network clicks versus all of the conversions. So you could literally have one affiliate in here just killing it and, and kind of drastically making these numbers um, not accurate. So, But it is a good indicator of what's actually getting traffic and conversions. So when you look in here, you can see Fresh Start Initiative. There's a tax offer. Uh, clearly, their top earnings per click right now is in tax. That makes sense because we're right in the tax time. We also have debt settlement, another financial type of offer. That would be something to potentially focus on. Bitcoin, there is an opportunity there because people are kind of scared of how the stock market's working. It's a good time to use angles like now is the best time to look at Bitcoin. You know, people are worried about the economy. And that's when people look at other opportunities like Bitcoin profits and stuff like that. Uh, coming down here, I got a lot of crypto. We have Bitcoin again, tax relief, Bitcoin, 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 all that stuff. And moving down, you know, then we're getting into diet and just kind of some ideas to look at that I think are really going to, to work well during this time. And it's going to continue to work. So myself, my main focus right now is the make money online niche because it's working really well for me. Uh, a lot of people looking to make money and I'm actually finding good legitimate uh, stuff to give them. Um, of course, we have our affiliate marketing training, but not everyone wants to be an affiliate. There's a lot of people out there that want to make money doing stuff online, freelancers, all that kind of stuff. So what I've been doing is setting up some listicles in terms of how to make money online. So obviously, I recommend the affiliate marketing stuff because I do uh, the training inside Powerhouse Affiliate, but I also recommend you know surveys for people. They can do surveys and make money. They can freelance. They can do whatever they want. Uh, a lot of people don't have the desire to be an affiliate, but if you're watching this video, you likely know what CPA affiliate marketing is. You know there's a massive potential to make money, especially in paid advertising. So I'm going to leave it there. There's some great ideas for how to make money with CPA affiliate marketing right now during this time. You don't have to get into the weird offers that I was talking about earlier where we're promoting masks and, and, and crap products. Okay, There's stuff here that we can actually give people that might actually help them. All right, if you liked that video, please subscribe to my channel, like or comment, share, ask questions, provide your own tips if you have any, and we'll see you in the next videos.